Right guys, we're back on Worms Battlegrounds with mission number 19, and if it's the right mission, which I think it possibly will be, then this mission was requested that I hurry up and get it done. And I would have done this walkthrough a lot quicker, but at the minute, as you would have seen, I am quite addicted to FIFA. I'm getting back into playing FIFA, and I can't get enough of it right now. I'm literally playing the game every single day. I'm not even playing Battlefield 4 that much. But we're on worms for now and I'm going to try and get this done as quick as I can and let's jump straight into the mission. The natives of Hokalugi once gave me the fabled glass armpit of their god, Terry the Mean. I say gave, I actually just took it, but they had been hogging it for 9,000 years. You have to get back what's not right for yours in this world. You too. That crate the enemy snaffled a few missions ago. That's your mission now. There's a weapon stash here. My butler airdropped it earlier for you. And there's a crate containing the magic map that always knows the whereabouts of the golden child. You must keep it safe as I can flog it when this is all over. Right guys, here we go. If you can hear my Xbox in the background, I do apologize. It is quite close to my mic. We need to get down that way. Right, please. He has to get far enough. Right, yes, he can jump far enough. I thought for some reason he might not be able to, and there's mines in there as well, so we've got to be careful of them. Right, we've got five parachutes, and we've just been shot. I messed that up a tiny little bit, but we should be okay. I'm hoping we'll be okay. No! Oh my god! Oh wow, <laughs> that worked out perfectly. Right, we've got a health crate down here. We only actually have 30 seconds. 50 health, there we go. I think that brings us up to 61. <gasps> no! Oh my god. Yeah, that is death down there. Right, there we go. On to that one. Yes. Grenades, shotguns... More health, I can't see how much that was. Phew, we got the weapon stash first. Smashing job. You can now use them to transform these enemy worms into one big worm souffle. Right, well that was pointless. Just scouting the area, we have all the worms are on the left hand side. We've got 111 health, so that health crate contained 50 health. And there's five enemy worms. Right, does he fit through there? He should do, yep, there we go. Right, we're not going to grab the checkpoint. We have grenades. So, actually, if we jump over to here. Five second timer. Drop that down there with him and get the head out of there. 45 damage, one worm down, four to go. Right, if we go to that guy, hopefully this mine don't kill us. Right, if we work our way around the left, get up to the top, get rid of that guy, then we'll save this guy down here for last. And hopefully we'll have enough health, we won't even need that health crate. Right, we are going to... We'd leave that with you. Oh, ten health left. This guy might be able to do some damage. I don't know what that blue, whatever this thing is here. I don't know what that does, but if he could destroy it and he could do something to us, or he could go for that and damage himself and drop a mine on our head. Thanks for that. Thank you. 56 damage, but he's almost killed himself. So, we're just going to shotgun him. Right, if we get this side, shotgun him. There we go, he's going to die. 70 damage. 
Right, and then if we shotgun this, we'll see what this can actually do. I'm zoomed in a little bit too much. Right, it releases water. That was the hope. And it's going to drop him down and not do any damage. <laughs> that was completely pointless. Wait, did they blow up? Oh, thank God he didn't destroy the health crate. Landed right next to us. There we go, 50 health. So if we drop down this side, we've avoided the checkpoint because you, you don't really need a checkpoint. It just wastes your turn. So if we drop down here, go grab the health. And telekinesis, I don't know what we'd use that for actually. No, well, I was going to trap him in, but we don't need to do that. We'll just leave a five second time on a grenade down here with him. Or just let it roll all the way down. Right, we messed that turn up. Now he's probably going to do some damage. We've got 150 health though, so it shouldn't really matter. Oh, ready for the bazooka. Direct impact as well. It's only done 35 damage, not bad. Oh, he's back up to 10 because that guy's health region, radius, whatever you want to call it, is ridiculous. So now we're going to bazooka this guy. If we can get him. Should be able to from there. There we go. Right, two worms left. One's got seven health. And that guy up there's got 55. Right, let's go back up this way. If we can. I don't think we're going to be able to. No, round the long way we go. Right, if we just shotgun him. Move down a little bit more. There we go. Right, and then it gives us time to get closer to the final enemy. If we stay under here, then that guy shouldn't be able to do damage to us unless he's got a parachute and does some weird, weird stuff. Are you serious? That's actually just happened. Do we actually have any way? We don't have any way of getting up to him. No, he's moving towards us. Oh, that could have been a really bad move. No. Miss. Yes. Oh, my God. He's actually missed it. Thank you. Oh, and he lost health. Right, I'm getting away from that edge. That's the first thing I'm doing. Right, actually, if we sit down here, there's a bazooka up there. Oh, oh, that could have been a much bigger drop. Oh, he's dead. He is dead. And we are slowly dropping. Right, we've got to go back up this way, I think. Right, we didn't even need the checkpoint, but we was pretty lucky. So make sure you grab checkpoints whenever you can. Ninja rope. Why did I not go there earlier in the level? Right, is that all we have to do? I think that's the end of the mission once we get up to there. Right, wait, we're going to have to ninja rope that. Right, this should be the end of the level, guys. Okay, right, this could be... I think I'm on the right mission because someone said they'd killed every enemy worm and done everything and it wouldn't end the level. And honestly, right now, I don't have a clue what to do. Because this is exactly how I did it last time. But this time is not ending. So I'm going to go grab the checkpoints and see if that's going to allow us to end the mission. I don't see why it would, but it's the only thing I can think of. Because there's no enemy worms. We're literally just trapped on a supposed to be finished level, which hasn't actually ended. Right, no, the checkpoints have not worked. Right, I'm really, really confused because it finished the level for me before. Because you would have seen when I started this mission off, when I done my little intro, that I said 
the, well, not that I said, the thing was green, which shows you I've completed it. And there wasn't anything else that I, I didn't do anything differently. Right, I'm going to start the mission again. I'm going to grab the checkpoints early on. Because if I restart from a checkpoint now, it's just going to be pointless because all the enemy worms are dead. It could work, we will try restarting from the checkpoint. But if not, I'll restart the mission, I'll go through it, and then when I come to the end, I'll hope and pray that it's actually worked. And I'll show you the mission ending, if I can, but it might not. Right, so let's try restarting from the checkpoint. Right, and it seems as though it's not actually done anything. Right, and we have done absolutely everything. We've parachuted down there, grabbed the first switch thing which starts this, gets it into a position so we can jump onto it, get across, and grab that switch to release the door. Then we killed every single worm and picked up the map of Worm Law or whatever it's called. And it's not worked, so I'm going to restart the mission, and then I'll start recording again at the end of the mission, and I'll show you guys the end if it works. If not, I don't know what else to suggest because I've completed this mission and I didn't do anything differently. Right guys, so I've done exactly the same thing again. I've killed every worm except for the one up the top which we're just going to go and try and kill now. Hopefully this time it'll work. If not, I'm sorry but I don't know what else to suggest because I've completed the mission I didn't do anything different. I'll grab the checkpoint as well so if it does mess up I can go back because I've got one more theory of what works but I'm not sure if it's a guarantee because usually if you go too far ahead of the game just wait for him to damage himself if you go too far ahead of the game if you go and grab that crate before you kill the enemies then it tells you to finish off the enemy worms so if we do that it could fix it I'm not sure but I will try after Oh, he's got two health left. No way. No way. I don't even have the ninja rope. This is going to have to be a lucky throw. I'm going to have to chuck a grenade and hope and pray. No, 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 no. Oh, that was pretty close. The ninja ropes all the way down there. Oh, he's coming closer. No, 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 no. He could actually kill us if we're not careful. Right, I'm just going to get away from him for now. I'm going to go and grab the... Oh, wow, there's... there's <laughs> I'm, I'm lucky there's two ways down there. I'm going to go grab the ninja rope, and then I'll finish him off, and then grab the crate. I must say, that was epic. That kill was awesome. Right guys, let's go and grab this and hopefully it works this time. Because the first time I did it, the first time I played this mission, it worked straight away. There has to be a way up there. Right, he didn't say that last time. Splendid, we got the map back. We need to end Mesmer's plans once and for all, so regroup with the others. My guess is they'll be in the museum gift shop, looting frisbees and notepads with their names on them. Get me one with Tara on. It don't get much better than this. Right guys, there we go. It worked for the second time, so if you do get stuck... There is a fix. I don't know if it's going to work every single time, but if you restart the mission, grab that first checkpoint, and then kill all the worms. That's how I got it to work just then, and you saw the final kill, and then uh, going to grab the crate with the map in, or whatever it was. So I hope that restarting the mission works for you. If it don't, I'm sorry, but I don't know any other way to fix it. But that, guys, was mission number 19 completed, and that is the end of this video. I hope you enjoyed it, and I hope it helped you. Thank you for watching.